Investing in Tesla? Are you nuts? I used to think that people who invest in Tesla were nuts because they didn't bother to read financial reports. And I was so wrong. So in this video, I want to share with you some investment advice that I wish knowing earlier so that you don't have to miss out this opportunity to 10x your wealth like I did. I'm Chloe and welcome back to my channel, a channel dedicated to inspire ladies and help ladies to start investing the safe way. And of course, if you are a smart guy, you are welcome too. I've been investing for a couple of years and I was pretty much brought up in this environment of value investing during the infant year of my investment journey. And if you are not sure what is value investing, think of Warren Buffett, the most famous value investor on earth who has a net worth of 85 $5 billion. So when it comes to value investing, it advocates looking into the company's performance such as earnings, cash flow, and whether does it have a sound business model. Most importantly, it really focuses on the consistency of the performance because Warren Buffett believes that when business does well, the stock price will eventually follow. So using value investing, I invested in companies like Facebook, Google, Microsoft, Amazon, which has very, very healthy profits. At the same time, it's still growing very very healthy and stately. However, when people talk about stocks like Tesla, I will immediately shun away. Because I thought that, hey, look at the financial reports, it didn't even make money. Why do you want to invest in companies that have been losing money in fact? So I thought investing in Tesla was like gambling because it was a lousy business. And only in recent months, I start to realize that how ignorant I was and how stubborn I was, you know, to receiving new ideas. Because when I look deeper into the business model of Tesla, I realized that it has built up a very strong economic mode and it has supreme technology over all the competitors. Last year, while so many automakers were shrinking in sales due to COVID-19, Tesla was the company that continued to make more sales and in fact, it produced and delivered half a million vehicles just like Elon Musk promised. And the level of production and delivery is the largest in the EV sector. On top of that, its energy side of business is also growing with the mission and vision of bringing clean energy to the rest of the world. I'm not going to dissect deep into the business model of Tesla because that's going to take another video. But if you do want me to share my findings on Tesla, do comment Tesla below and I will do a video if you find it useful. My point is I was being so ignorant and so stubborn to receiving new ideas, investing in disruptive companies like Tesla. And that's how I really miss up the 700% gain in one year. And now I realize that when it comes to investing, there is no best method. Even though value investing has been a very, very time-tested method, however, there's always a better way. And a better way comes from you willing to continue to invest in yourself and expand your investment horizon as well as your understanding, you being able to receive new ideas. Now I'm officially a Tesla shareholder. I bought it before the end of last year, which is about $600 plus. Is it expensive? Yes, if you compare to like nine months ago when it was only $70. But if you look at the long-term growth that Tesla is expanding itself into, as well as the positive impact that it's bringing to the world, no, I don't think it's expensive. So this year, I will continue to add more positions into Tesla shares and I will update you when I do so. So next time, if you hear investment ideas that you think are ridiculous, before you judge, make sure you do your own proper research and then decide for yourself, is it indeed nuts or you are nuts? And from now on, I will also be posting more YouTube videos frequently to update about my investment journey as well as my investment insights. If you don't want to miss that out, do remember to click that subscribe button and I will also appreciate if you like this video so that more people will be able to see it and be inspired and start investing in 2021. I hope this lesson will be useful for you during this new year and once again, Happy New Year and happy investing.